On July 10, that is tomorrow, the Election Commission of India will conduct by-elections in 13 assembly seats across seven states. These states include Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Punjab, Bihar, West Bengal, Madhya Pradesh and Tamil Nadu. Out of the 13 seats, 10 were vacated by the MLAs as they resigned and defected to other parties, while three MLAs passed away. The poll in all three seats of Himachal Pradesh would be interesting, as the posts were vacated by independent MLAs who later went and joined the BJP. The same candidates will now fight from BJP against important Congress MLAs which includes the current CM's wife, Kamlesh Thakur. Hence, a defeat for Congress is a direct attack on the CM's popularity in the state. As the grand old party holds a majority in the 68-seat assembly, BJP would really want to win all these three seats. There will be a clear lookout for people's verdict in three out of four bipole seats of Bengal. The posts were vacated after BJP MLAs defected to the ruling party Trinamool Congress. The question now is, can BJP retain these seats with three new candidates? In the West Punjab seat, AAP MLA Sheetal Angural resigned and joined the BJP. As AAP's performance in the recent Punjab Lok Sabha was not up to the mark, this by-election may speak for the party standing in the state assembly.